one of my battle buddies and I were out on a detail loading magazines with rounds, changing out targets, um, counting targets. That day we were doing uh, point and shoot and prior to that we had done linen turn in. So none of our beds were made. So everything was stripped and we got back at almost midnight thinking, oh geez, now we're gonna have to go in there and make this bed. And we walked in and all of our battle buddies had made all of our beds for us. And that right there just, it's a small thing, but it really meant a lot to us because we were really, really tired and had been up earlier than everybody else and up later than anybody else. And they, they saw that and they, out of you know, gratitude and respect for the detail work we had done all day, they uh, took a little bit extra time out of their time to go ahead and do us, a, do us a favor and make our beds for us. I didn't even know who did it because most everybody was already asleep. Um, I had to wait until the next morning to find out who I needed to thank. I didn't think that she uh, was always a team player, so it was actually um, unexpected that she did it, and I was really grateful. I was a little overwhelmed, actually, because you know you get to the point where some of us are getting, I think, a little bit on each other's nerves. It made me kind of think twice about how I'd been feeling about that person, and and maybe that um, it's a two-way street. Maybe I wasn't as open to giving her a chance. Um, giving her an opportunity to do something like that and maybe it could have happened a lot sooner. It made me respect her a lot more, um, be more willing to help somebody else when, they're, when you realize that they're more willing to help you. We've definitely, definitely come a long way since day one as a team.